had ever seen. Looking about her, Goldilocks saw three bowls of porridge sitting on the table. She went up and tasted the first bowl, but it was much too hot. Then she tasted the next bowl. It was much too cold. When she tasted the last bowl, it was so delicious that she ate it all up. she was finished, she went over and sat down in a great big chair. But it was too hard. Then she tried the next chair. But it was too soft. Then she tried the last little chair. But when she sat down, it broke all to pieces. Goldilocks went upstairs and saw three beds all in a row, just as the dishes of porridge and the chairs had been. She tried the first bed, but no, it was too hard. She tried the second one, but it was much too soft. Then she tried the third bed, and before you could say Jack Robinson, little Goldilocks was fast asleep. Soon the owners of this cozy little cottage returned, singing happily, We're so glad to be home, glad to be home, glad to be home. We're as glad to be home as any bears can be. But as they looked around their precious little home, they noticed immediately that things were not as they had left them. Little Bear said, Someone has been eating my porridge and has eaten it all up. Then they saw that their chairs had been used, and Baby Bear cried, Someone has sat in my chair and broken it all to pieces. Who could have eaten the porridge and who could have sat on the chair? 